Safety Toolbox Talk Number 299 Mobile Crane Safety and Inspection Checklist 1. The physical condition of the crane body should be sound and free from any structural damage. 2. The safe working load, SWL, must be clearly marked and visible. 3. A spirit level should be installed and in working order. 4. The front, reverse, and swing horns must be functional. 5. The operator must possess a valid and suitable license for the crane operation. 6. The hoist limit switch must be functional and properly calibrated. 7. The boom should be in good condition, with no cracks, damage, or jamming, particularly when fully extended. 8. The wire rope must be free from any visible damage or wear. 9. There should be no oil leakage from the hydraulic system. 10. The safe load indicator, SLI, must be fully operational. 11. The tires must be free from damage, including issues such as damaged bolts, cracks, cuts, or improper air pressure. 12. A fire extinguisher must be available in the operator's cabin. 13. The crane simulator should be in proper working condition. 14. The side mirrors should be intact and in good working order. 15. The safety latch on the hook must be in good working condition. 16. The head and tail lights, as well as the indicators, must be in proper working condition. 17. The outriggers, including the spreader mats, must be in good condition and operational. 18. A first aid kit must be available and fully stocked. 19. The crane should be in good physical condition and possess a valid third-party inspection, TPI, certificate. 20. The communication equipment, such as radios or hand signals, are in working order. 